Surveillance video shows the owner of a five month old pit bull punching and dragging it. And now we're getting an exclusive look at how the dog is doing with its new owner. Channel 2's Liz Arts live in DeKalb County. And Liz, the dog's owner, says that the dog is thriving now. Says that she is adapting well. That video was caught on these cameras right out here at this convenience store just about two weeks ago. But her new owner says that she's really smart. She has adapted well. She even knows commands like sit and stay. She's got a, a loving home now where she has. Um, Toys and um, a lot of love, and a lot of other dogs to play with. This woman, who asked to remain anonymous, gave us an exclusive look at five month old Nala. She adopted the pit bull puppy a week ago after police arrested her original owner and charged him with animal cruelty. Detectives say that's 26 year old Kirby Crane seen on surveillance video punching the puppy and then dragging her through the parking lot May 9th. My first thought was, how can you do that? But also, if you do that to an animal, what would you do? You know, to a human. We stopped by Crane's house Monday to see if he had an explanation for punching the dog. No one answered. Police think the 26 year old was training the dog to be aggressive towards humans and animals. Nala's new owner says she has witnessed aggressive behavior. There's some growling, there's some aggression there. But for the most part, she told us Nala is sweet and very smart. She'll sit, lay down, and she's, she's a very smart dog. Very smart. She told us Nala is adjusting well to her two other rescue dogs, and she's still horrified when she sees this video of how the five month old puppy was treated. How could anyone do something like that? And if they would do that to an animal, what would they do to an infant, a toddler, a girlfriend, a wife? Now, police say that the dog's former owner was apparently upset because he was out here socializing with other customers and possibly even ate a candy bar. We know that the dog was spayed and is now current on all of her shots. Live in DeKalb County, Liz Arts, Channel 2 Action News.